Welcome to Grizzlies Legendary Moments presented by Budweiser. Pete Branica alongside Chris Vernon, Michael Wallace, the 2015 NBA playoffs. Grizzlies eliminate Portland in five games. That's the good news. Bad news is Mike Conley in game three suffers massive facial fractures courtesy of a CJ McCollum elbow. Doesn't play game one at Golden State. Game two, he decides to play. It will be forever known, Chris, as the broke face game. It will be the broken face game. Number one, dad doesn't want him to play. Mom doesn't want him to play. Wife doesn't want him to play. And he came back way too early. And I think Conley could not take it watching after game number one. And if it was possible he could play, he was going to play. So that one will be ingrained in my mind forever. But it was, I mean, it's all time. Grizzlies performance that will be virtually impossible to duplicate. It wasn't just the facial fracture and the pain. It was the pain meds causing him nausea. He couldn't even eat. He couldn't eat. Yes, I was there too. I was on an assignment for ESPN nationally. And I remember talking to Mike about how the thing was the mat. They had to get the right mask to fit first of all. And then the problem was before that game, his eye didn't, the swelling didn't go down enough. So the, the eye was still protruding out to where he couldn't get the mask to fit comfortably. That's the only reason why he didn't push to play in game, you know, the game before that. Mm -hmm. So when he finally got out there, it was, you know, he was on cloud nine. I mean, just that game he talked about, as you said, Chris, afterwards, I had to basically, you know, disobey my mom. And that was the hardest part about, you know, deciding to play in that game. I can't imagine a more courageous performance by anybody because like I said, the pain, the mask, the fact that he wasn't eating or sleeping, I mean, I don't know that you're right. I don't think you can really even top this. I mean, when you team up, coming back with a broken face, playing one of the greatest teams ever in their arena, and then being the best player on the floor for a good measure of time that you're out there. Yeah, in an insanely loud building, yes. which aggravated some of the pain and yep. discomfort that Mike was feeling. It did, it did. And just to see how that game was sort of the catalyst for what happened the game after that. The Grizzlies were up 2-1 in that series. They had control of that series, and then another injury happens to Tony Allen at the end of game four, and that takes them out of the series there with the, uh, with the hamstring. But what Mike Conley did was infuse this organization with a lot of confidence. It's one of those situations where the Grizzlies were on the cusp of something great because of the courageousness that Mike Conley played with with that broken face. Mike Conley, broke face game. Broke face. Broke face. <laughs> hey, Memphis Grizzlies, legendary moment presented by Budweiser.